I'm Laura Trevelin in Washington, and this is BBC World News America. Across Kazakhstan, there's a national state of emergency as protesters storm government buildings. Now, peacekeepers from a Russian-led alliance are being deployed to help stabilize the country. The French president wants to make life difficult for unvaccinated people in France as governments across Europe struggle with how to stop the spread of the Omicron variant. Investigating the Capitol riot nearly one year on, we have a special report on the election conspiracy theories which helped spark the attack. With tens of thousands of Russian troops still close to the Ukrainian border, the EU's top diplomat goes to Kyiv amid rising tensions. Plus, making history in the cold, we have the story of a woman breaking barriers as she reaches the South Pole. Welcome to World News America on PBS and around the globe. We begin tonight in Central Asia, in the former Soviet Republic of Kazakhstan, where there's a nationwide state of emergency tonight. Anti-government protests have taken place across the country for a fourth day. What began as demonstrations against the rising price of fuel have spiralled into something much bigger. Protesters have stormed an airport and seized government buildings. And now, peacekeepers from a Russian-led alliance will be sent to Kazakhstan to help stabilise the country. Our correspondent Paul Adams has more. 